If we can piece together all the different data sets that are available, then we can revolutionise diagnosis and treatment. The hope I really have is we really manage to make diagnosis more accurate. The potential of big data in cancer science is absolutely huge. I think there's a huge potential of standardising diagnoses more. Can we include data in a pathology report that can be read anywhere and it's not objective, it's not specific to a human interpretation? Big data applications could mean a lot for patients in the future. It could improve their diagnostic procedures they receive, helping them find cancers earlier and potentially even preventing them. At the moment I'm working on aiming to make the richest possible data set of colorectal cancer data from across the UK, trying to find any inequalities or inequities that may exist in how treatments are given and, and in outcome too. Oxford is, is very highly connected across multiple different disciplines. The level of excellence in research, really in all different areas of research. We've got data scientists, we've got epidemiologists, we've got statisticians, we've got people at computer science who experts in machine learning and artificial intelligence. Bringing these things together in a highly collaborative setting, I think this is what makes Oxford unique. One important aspect of the future of data science in cancer research is to work on prospective data that is updated very regularly and routinely. That would allow us to develop tools and methods that will also have a higher chance of success for the future. Clinicians can also see the results of our work. It would have direct impact for patients as well, but I think we need to accelerate the transition. I think that would be a wonderful step forward.